She's a new matriarchal judge on the Great British Bake Off, having replaced grandmotherly ex-judge Mary Berry. But 77-year-old Prue Leap's past has proven less sweet and more savory, as it transpires it involves John's sex clubs and naked encounters at French Archie's. As reports the Daily Star, who attended a party that turned out to be an organized orgy, where, we were the only people with any clothes on when she used to live in Paris. She recalled that one room was carpeted with wall-to-wall -wall population, young bottoms going up and down like bouncy castles and that her companion at the soiree. Pierre took his clothes off and disappeared into the throng. Keeping to Pierre's one and lone attitude about the situation, who undressed too and at once became less conspicuous, she recounted. I spent the next two hours walking purposefully from room to room. Trying to look as if I had a sexual tryst arranged in the next room or was on my way to the bar or the loo, she said. I was avoiding the men patrolling the party, CKS aloft. They brought to mind cars prowling about in search of a slot to park in. I was amazed at the variety of models on offer, penises that were stubby, fat, bent. Grey, pink, brown, crimson. One guy was so proud of his, and it was impressive, that he never put it to use, but merely paraded about like an athlete with an Olympic banner. The South African native was in her late teens when she moved to France. After which she went to live in London. It's well documented that the scandal doesn't stop there, and that, at 21, she began a 13-year affair with the husband of her mother's best friend. One evening, when we were in the kitchen, he kissed me. I wish I could say I objected, but I didn't. So began a 13-year affair, she wrote in her memoir around. I was utterly infatuated. I fell completely, thunderously and irredeemably for the husband of my mother's best friend and partner. Poor man, the friend, had no idea of the serpent she had let into her nest. There was a drug scandal too, with Prue renting a room in her youth to pop group The Hollies. I used to hide the group's hash for them among my dried herbs, but no one ever came asking. She has also admitted to taking LSD which caused her to realize how incredibly dangerous they can be after taking them led to a nightmare of terror and hallucinations.